Speaking of GBO, so Donnie, if you could just go to like number three. So GBO. He bailed out, right? Now listen, now folks are suspecting six, like 600 of being the one who paid the bail because they're saying, because he someone was attached or signed to 600 at, at some point or have somehow, right? Like working with 600 and the bill was 500,000 with, with like 50K being like, right? And yeah. it was paid, and he out. So apparently, though, who did him like that? Yeah. So yeah. Uh, make that big. Yeah. Right. And he claims though um, that he was at his girl's place, or he was with with like his girl, and the girl dad like broke into like like, like the home and fucked him up for being with with the girl. Right. Broke, broke in or came Believable. in. Th- th- this girl's home. He right? came in without him knowing they was gonna come. Right. right? Regardless. Right. But and hope, he said broke in, but I'm assuming he came in. But yeah, like for some reason, like we could like enlarge it. Was she supposed to be a minor? Uh, so okay, so like she claims, um, that he got with her when she was like 15 years old and he was like 20, mm. and, and now she's like 19 and he's like 24, <laughs> 25. So like you're painting the picture of what a day to day in his life would have been is like. So you yeah. wake up in the morning, you go over to a famous hood and you walk around with a walker <laughs> or a wheelchair or whatever to try yeah, to make fun of some some dead ops, yeah, not GBO, oh. and then you're saying that he was with 15 year olds after that that's, that's quite a day oh he got to him though shout out to pops you feel me hey, but, pops but, got witty. but 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 I, I ain't gonna take that to the bank because man she she 19 now you know what i'm saying i, I don't know but if he been on her for four years and he's been grown for four years he got it took I, four that's years allegedly, and though. the next tab is allegedly, the one that alleges allegedly, that about him if too. allegedly yeah. that was facts he got what he deserved <clears throat> If not, maybe he didn't. But if allegedly that was correct, salute yeah. to the correctness and of the situation. And how old was he at the time when she was 16 or 15? Like he like, was like, like 19 he- 19 when she was probably 15, right? Yeah. Right. I don't believe I don't nothing from this dude, I, for the record. Yeah. I, I feel like everything he says and does is it made is. up. Like I don't know. Chasing, I, 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 as you give your perspective, give it from the, a, a dad, a, a dad, a girl father, a girl dad perspective. Yeah. Nah, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta be optimistic and do from a bird's eye view type shit, cause, cause, I wanna know how old was he when she was sixteen? Uh, and he was nineteen. No, she 15, was 15. 19, 16, 20. So she, he four was years 20. older. He was nineteen. She was fifteen. Yeah. Not that could have been a high school together. But I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Ooh, wait though. According to her, this is a nigga that's really. Yeah. Acclimated to the streets, because in the streets that yeah. makes a whole lot of sense. Oh. Do. outside yeah. of the streets as a father, that is that's boo boo. Yeah, right. So look, according to her, so she says, "All right, since we doing it up, go call this ninja a pedo." I met GBO when I was fifteen. He told me he was nineteen years old. He was really twenty one at the time, mm. right? And having intercourse with a minor for years. I'm barely turning nineteen in June. Now GBO says m- says man you cap uh so here so so look he says man you cap you start sucking me off randomly I told your weird ass stop and you lied about being pregnant had me send you six hundred dollars for an abortion so like he never really quite addressed he's making the same um, mistake that your boy made right your boy your boy Demix. They should not be addressing these allegations publicly, period. But all right. Wait. Four year age difference doesn't sound that bad to me as an adult. But when you think about it, when you're 19, <laughs> you are in your first year out of high school. And when you're 16 or 15, when you're yeah. 15, you are still in ninth grade. That's a fact. Mm-hmm. So you that to me, like 10th, 11th, 12th was high school. Yeah. I know it's like 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th out here, I think. But yeah. like either way, like you're skipping a whole chapter of your life going like to high going school. Back to A76 is different. That's not a good one. It's you a should, big difference. A7 you can't do that. Is different than you know, 10, 11, 12. Yeah. The crazy thing about it is, big I know like the dad whooped on him, right? Yeah. In Long Beach, anybody from Long Beach that's watching, they 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 go they know the story. But <clears throat> nobody wasn't. They was all the same age and everything. But it was the few of the homies, or the ex homies, they they was at a chick house, right? And dad came home with. The dude still in the house. He laid all the dudes down, like laid them all mm. down, like stacked them on top of each other type shit. Mm. And shot through them. Mm. Shot what? Through them a few she times. Boom, boom, boom. You're talking about this story? No. This no, a different one. Story that okay. Happened in Long Beach. Mm. Really? You know what I mean? So, so you really from Long Beach? You know this story? No, no. If you from Long Beach, you know the story. That's right? the craziest sounding thing I can imagine. How long ago was this? Just like ten. 
plus years. So y'all knew the niggas. Yeah, man, it's the ex homie. Yeah, like Damn. he used to be the homie, but he they told. was forcing themselves or just having the fun. He told on that situation. He told on the dad. He told on the dad. Wow. But were they having f- the other what, people what, died? He survived. Was no, they, wasn't my was they I forcing? Were they just, just doing the? Nah, they was just in there together. You it know who you could force. blame? You know who you could blame was, for that? It right? wasn't by force. Nothing. You know it's that, the girl. You know who you could blame for that culture? The girl. Oh, what? ain't no fun. <laughs> no, no, it's a fact though. Her her house probably just a hangout. But no, bro, but that listen, listen, they wasn't that, even that song from my set understanding. a tone for a culture, a generation of young black kids, especially in Los Angeles. <clears throat> yeah, but from my understanding, they wasn't over there like they was flipping her or nothing like that. Right. They, it was just a hangout. But pops come home like, what you doing? All these people up in here. Oh, they wasn't even feeling. You feel what I'm saying? First, and and uh, they wasn't getting. You no, know, first thing, first thing, pops thing is. Was he affiliated? All dudes in here with my one daughter. Was he affiliated? Yeah, of course. Hey, listen. She man. must have been in a compromised position. They wasn't just sitting there smoking weed. See, it's one of the houses that's cracking. We, we what know you the girl. About? You, but you know if, if you catch it, if you catch the girl, it's the home girl. But if it, if you catch it before it go down, you finna just kick everybody out. Mm. No, not him. Evidently. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, the, well, stacking them up and shooting them. So you yeah, tell me he pointed the gun down bro, and shot through a pile of bodies? Else. Everybody was laying on their stomach. Okay, now but he laying on his back. It's for you guys. Now he's laying on his back. She's right. laying he was on his doing back. Something. Doesn't like that feel people. like not enough information for you to murder four bro, people? Bro. So after and she got him beat up, after she posted his address, he's now on Instagram begging her to come back. For one, she didn't get him beat up. He got caught. Yeah, facts. So she didn't get him beat up. So yeah. this, this is not a troll. This is really his account saying this. Yes, shit. right? And he says, yo, Juicy, done, well, please come back to the house. Everyone DM her. Lost my girl. First person to get her to to to, to uh, reply back, get $40 in cash app. Uh, why you leave me like this? You know arguments supposed to be between us. You the got family The only person involved. that is attracted to this shit and appreciated is Adam. They fuck around and can get a blue face and Krishan situation fucking with Adam. For the record, I really don't fuck with him because okay. he came to my crib. So yeah. I really I like a gun. Crib crib? Yeah, but with a gun, you know. Like, yeah, I was okay. in the room. But so that was like a couple years ago. But so that's why, you know, I'm not really like saying so, too much, but I do think like he definitely. Hey, so, so, so the, the, the jails were invented for him. Basically, that's <laughs> what I'm trying to say. Well, lock his ass up. But you know, they're going to say milk in your place of business. Your house and GBO, what's the big difference? Nah, bro, that's a little different, business. right? He don't live here. Yeah, nah, that's the difference. I, most look, we in a corporate America. This is all we know him for to be as a capitalist. <clears throat> your place of business is almost as sacred as your home. No, nah, that, nah. That, his nah. family don't live here, bro. Yeah, okay. yeah. Say less. And to bring a gun is a little different to come to to you know like to like, you know to like catch the fader. You feel me, I, right? I, I understand how sacred the home actually is. I just, oh, yeah, hey, you okay. could get. I'm gonna take it very very personal though. Either way though. Thank you. Even though, even though the home is more sacred, but you there are degrees, but yeah. it's, it's still I, 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 bro, it's up to somebody just came in front of your home putting gasoline. Bro. That's what I'm reflecting so, so, on right now. So that's not equivalent to coming to <laughs> yeah. the, the studio you program out of. Nah, not at all. Not, that's, that's why no I say it's not as sacred as the home, but I'm gonna still take it personal though. Gasoline. Yeah. Oh man, no, 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 no. no, 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 no I want to know. I want to know. Six hundred really thought about, especially at the drink. Say bodies being found on green leaf with they. And heads cut off, and then it's end up being gasoline on Greenleaf at my location. That's crazy. How much you? GBO, uh, he he went disrespecting the sixties too. So I wonder, like, why would why would why would uh? Yeah, that's the name. Bell him out. Yeah, right. So like, that's the big rumor right now, right? Because so GBO was in jail on a five hundred thousand dollar bill for some robberies, um, and and he got out. So he paid at least at least like ten percent, which is like around the fifty thousand. That's right? not true. What's up? Oh, Bell right. Bonds, I mean, I mean Bell's, you call around to Bell's yeah, Bonds. Yeah, they gonna give some way cheaper. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah bet. One percent, bro. Oh, sure, right. But see, that's why we gotta do podcasts to with 10, the street dudes yeah. who know what they're talking about. He probably had to have ten uh, or fifteen thousand, though. I bet, right? So folks were, I guess, accusing like six hundred a billion him out, but we don't know, right? But I, mm. um, right, but though, here's the question, though. I don't with believe his, that I, about six hundred. Can y'all understand why? Can y'all understand why he? He is such in a spell. No, no. I think you think, I think six hundred cap. What part? Did he say that he was bailing them out? No, no, no. Oh, yeah, about he, anything. He denies having any connection with him. Mm. Oh, really? I remember the six O's was pressing him about fucking with him on live one yeah. time. 
But he just right now recently said he yeah, don't know why him. people are connecting him to GBO. Who at is all. GBO? I don't even know. Who he's he is. just a random dude who trolls like every hood in LA. He's one of the biggest trolls. That he went to Whack House, pissed on the gate, and then he pissed on the Nipsey Miro. He, he, he went to Nipsey Miro, been disrespectful. He, I yeah. think he went to. Uh, Drove with, by a nigga from 40s and popped in came the Came to know John at 3 in the morning. Yeah. So <laughs> GVO. He's well, from Lakewood, though. The right. question is, though. Yeah. He, oh, what, what the f*** is yeah, taking everybody so long, yeah, bro? He's from your side of the big shit. So bro, they Lakewood. killed Block Boy. It took him like two months. What the f*** is taking so long with this kid? <laughs> and that's... Hurry the f*** up. The question is, oh, shit. how do y'all see this ending for GPO Gaston? You know how I want to see it. Ending. Not good. Yeah. Do you think it's redemption for him if he chose the, another approach? What you mean? Redemption. He's too Redemption. Like, you think After he, coming to somebody's house, I think that's unforgivable, bro. So, so you can work he, on that in the afterlife. What if he got baptized and start turning yeah, into right. fuck out of here? That's good for him and God, nigga. I wouldn't See, disrespected like, 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 like what? Like uh, in every gang in, in the city, and he, and, and he is still alive why, and striving. Why, so why you think Charleston White get away with it? Because he's not in LA. No, he did. He get, he gets invited on. Los Angeles yeah. based platform. Yeah, but he's an old head. What well, Los Angeles based, based platform? Yeah, yeah, what? A lot of this shit ain't what. Cause he, he used came to be, though, right? Cause the back of fake thing was over the phone. Yeah, oh, yeah. right. And they got no morals. <laughs> hey, but listen, man, right? And like what? he came to LA at like five in the morning and said that he got paid like twenty thousand to be in on a platform, but we never seen. Shout out to Charleston? Melvin Farmer. Yeah, right. Hmm. You feel me? You can accredit and blame Mel Melvin Farmer. For that, shout out to the home. No, you know, he never seen it though. Like, right, like, right, like, is he claims that he got paid to do like an interview in, in LA, but we never seen the quote unquote LA interview. I can't even think of who would pay 20k for an interview in LA besides like Vlad, who doesn't fuck with him. Yeah, no jumper, and him have never had a relationship. Who like Kev don't pay for interviews. He a regular with somebody, what's his name? He got a record. He a regular, regular. regular. Oh, oh say cheese. Uh, and where, where, say where's cheese. say cheese based out of? But they do everywhere, but technically Texas. Oh, yeah. But they have like cameramen real all over the place. Real life stars too. Ain't he a regular there at the Blue Couch? And that's Dallas, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, bro, but you got to understand how easy it is to go get get off the plane, go straight to your room, then go handle right. your business, then come back to the room, then get back on the plane. Right. People act like, people yeah. got like a radar or a... a, a uh, uh, Apple tag on somebody. Just, that's the thing about LAX. Came to LA. Mm. So many people yeah, working that like motherfucker. Half the time yeah. we don't even know they out here until they post it. When they post it, they already back in their state. But, yeah, but yeah. LAX is crucial because mm, yeah. somebody going to see you in that motherfucker. And if you one of them niggas out here nine times out of ten, yeah. if you know you got an issue with somebody, somebody in LAX will let you know they just came through the airport. Whenever I go to LAX though, nine times out of ten, I don't see anybody who look like they on anything you crazy bro for real you Damn. are too but, visible bro. but you got like crip brain mm -hmm. where yeah. you just see gang threats everywhere Indeed. like i have like normal I see dude brain, so but, i don't i don't see shit but, but, I, but, but i also have been going through lax since the early 2000s with a public presence mm -hmm. right so i know how well, who knows who we, we more visible than you realize you going through their humble sleepy mm -hmm. and not looking at nobody not realizing how many people are looking at you nigga. Mm -hmm. you don't know 60, 65 percent of the employees at LAX is game bangers. Yeah, and they all <laughs> everybody know who working you at LAX. But you don't see that many employees when you leave, and you see them on the way in. Yeah, of course. Yeah, but they come. Out, I don't know why they come out the woodworks for me. The squarest employee let me know they, they gonna wink at me. Mm -hmm. They gonna do something to let me know they know what's going on. No, yo, listen. No, look. I seem like like a clown, a YouTuber, right? Uh, and who does like uh, and hate videos now, right? So, and he posted like a receipt, I think like on like the Reddit, right? Where he's telling like, and his friend, yo, I seen Flacco at LAX. He's not 6'9", like he claims on Twitter. He's actually like five foot five. I saw somebody six, waking nine. you up. And he's a troll, right? You're like 5'9". Like, yeah, 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 right? No, we not 5'9". Who was that? Who was Don't give him that, that at him. Huh? I saw you sitting on the floor at LAX sleep and somebody woke you up. Keen, right? Uh, it, it, listen, <laughs> I am comfortable at the airport because I know, bro, there's no guns in here, right? But that wasn't LAX, right? Because none of us yeah. would have a reason to be sitting at LAX unless you were on the yeah. way out.